Greetings, I am Cross Knights, and the kingdom rushes on. I have to say, I really like this game. Usually when I play a game for the channel, I practice it, I record it, and then usually I'm done. Um, especially like the Flash games, you know? But I've been playing this one like for fun after beating it, which does not often happen. I've been going back and trying to do the challenges. On my other file, I have finally beaten the, uh, not the, the crazy challenge, but this challenge. I beat it. It was hard because it it's really hard because you can't mess up even once. <laughs> That's the main thing. But we're on this file and we're going to Storm Cloud Temple. Arriving at the Storm Cloud Temple has been the best thing to happen to us in days. The Storm Cloud Sorcerers will now be at your command, General, and they can open a portal straight to Valadubajabja. However, we must provide them with a defense while they complete their spell. Something abominable, abom the abominable snow something is approaching and the men are extremely nervous. That's probably just because they're all gonna be pounded to death. It's not, it's standard fare. Uh, Sorcerer's Tower. Curse enemies, damaging them and reducing their armor for a while. So we have two, two points of entry. And as always, one point of departure. I think they'll be able to block there. I want arrows. Actually, let's get, let's get artillery here. We want arrow here and here and an artillery here. And I want magic here here and here that'll do it let's see what happens we're fighting bandits we're fighting trolls but only two trolls up there we shall see what we shall see how's that troll faring he is he's gonna be the guy that i decide whether or not i need to nuke ah let's just nuke him anyway start early i say <laughs> get the money so i can upgrade yeah, I really want magic here as opposed to that. Be good to get the aforementioned sorcerer stuff. Now we got four trolls. I'm gonna... <laughs> if I couldn't handle two trolls all that well, we don't want four trolls quite yet. That would be a mistake, probably. Oh my god, please murder one of those guys right now. We need to murder... There we go. So, this stage actually has, they mentioned those sorcerers, they do exist in the game. Um, right here. I can pay money to get a sorcerer and then I get a special attack that only exists on the stage. I'm a little bit worried, I'm thinking they might break through here. Eh. No, it looks like both of them died. <laughs> my, my guys did their job. They're slowly picking away at them. And the four, the four trolls are coming though. Oh, but look what I have. <laughs> We can just get those trolls to stand a little bit closer together, maybe. I think we're gonna get the first one, though. And these are... I figured there'd be wolves. There's always wolves. I think we got this. Ad well, maybe. They're, they're always regenerating. It's hard to tell. Ah. Can't give them that opportunity. And also, to uh, send wolves directly into the path, also excellent. All right, and can't quite get that wizard's thing yet. I think I should probably not just try to get the get the really powerful building and neglect all other buildings for it. I think that's a mistake that I've done a few times. Let's get some more. Yeah, especially because that's coming. We got gargoyles inbound. Eight to be precise. Four on each side. Good, good, good. Now bottom's looking a little bit bad, but I might get my spell back soon. And there we go. These guys need to be better, considering that we're actually coming up against them repeatedly. All right, there we go. Uh, I think these trolls might get through. Let's just do it. Yeah, they, they, they're probably going to get through. Gargoyles, go. And I can't really do much about that. Let's see. Let's put... um. Artillery would be good there. That's not going to help me right now, so I'm not going to worry about it. 
Let's make the first sorcerer. So I can take this beam, which will do, I don't know, like 100 points of damage and be like, pew, dead. <laughs> and it's nice because it works on flying, guys. It works on anything. Shadow archers are coming. It is fun. Let's try, let's do another mage tower right here. Try to weaken guys as they come up. And as they pass, then we'll get a double magic burst right there. Because it looks like all the armored guys are on the bottom. Uh, click you, all right. So this recharges like every 20 seconds or so. The, the more, well, that hardly did anything. Oh my, that only did like 70 points of damage. But yeah, it's, it gets better as you go on. I'm just gonna drop some sunshine on your face. <laughs> and one more upgrade. That's much better. <laughs> I think the first level is only like 70 or something. You can get a maximum of four wizards here where it gets the most powerful, then it upgrades like you, you get to fire like every 13 seconds after that. It's nice. And we got a wolf round. Stop right there. Now, I would like to get a Sorcerer's Tower as fast as possible. There is a... it's One of its abilities is so good, it's, it's ridiculous. But... Uh-oh. Right, we got one of them. Two are getting through, though. <laughs> Alas, that was unfortunate. No, you stay right there. You just stay right there. It'll be fine. Got a troll champion coming up soon. Alright, that is on the cusp of being ready to upgrade. Pew! Look at that. Shredded ya. Shredded ya. Stay right there for one second. I got one of them. <laughs> this guy's getting, uh, he's healing himself faster than I'm damaging him. But what if he got hit by a sorcerer strike? Uh, still so. Still so. Come on. There we are. Just topped him off. I need 300 to get the thing I want. That is in range. We are close to it. Oh, damn it. <laughs> that is not what I wanted to happen. I wanted him to walk forward. I forgot he had a ranged attack. Ah, uh, whatever. We can do it. Sorcerer's Tower. So this will half armor of people hit by it for five seconds, which is really good. So they have high armor. This is not going to be half long. Also, Bew. <laughs> oh, well, he died before he got his armor heft, but you'll notice that it now says he has medium armor, and now it says he has low armor. Is it cumulative? Interesting. Hmm. Cool. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll also take that. So, the really amazing ability is this. Summon Elemental. It makes a extremely powerful golem that blocks for you, which is great. New enemy type, Dark Slayers. Claimed by darkness, Slayers are the bane of anyone standing in their way. Great armor, slow speed, very tough. We'll see about that. I'm gonna blast you. I don't even know if I hit him. I might have hit one of the little guys. That's okay though. So once I get this, I can summon a golem with 600 life, deals 50 to 90 damage, and blocks just like soldiers. It's like it gives you a free super brigade right in there. Uh, is he going to be a problem? He's probably going to be a problem. Uh, oh, there we go. Dead. <laughs> no longer a problem. Pew! There's trolls up top, brigands on the bottom. Wolves are already just... Yeah, they're getting shredded by what I got already. Very close to getting my wonderful little golem, which I'm going to put right here to block both paths. Boom. All right. You guys are in trouble now. There's so many trolls coming up, and they're all getting through. Oh, boy. Yeah, this place isn't really upgraded nearly high enough. Now, is the other ability is called Polymorph. You turn an enemy into a sheep, they lose all armor, they lose all abilities. The problem is that soldiers ignore them, probably because they're just a sheep. 
And if it's like a boss creature, like not a boss, but like a mini boss type creature that gets uh, turned into a sheep, they keep a lot of their health, which means they can sometimes just run past your troops. So in some ways, Polymorph is really dangerous depending on where it's placed. It's definitely be dangerous here. That is way too close to the entrance. If it was here, that would be good. The sheep would probably die. They even gain like a movement boost, I think. Also, this is a new enemy, the Rocket Riders. They are like gargoyles, but more annoying. They're just they're just knights with rocket packs. Half man, half machine. The rocket riders follow their dark lord wherever they go. So they can use a turbo boost and then go extremely fast and just get past your defenses, and it's really annoying. They don't have any armor though. Which is good. And they're only sending three after me right now. But still gotta be careful. We're gonna No, I really gotta upgrade some other things. I should ignore those sorcerers for a little bit. Um, bloop. <laughs> Goodbye. He definitely would have gotten through otherwise unless I used my fire from above. Now I can use this to make the, the golem even stronger, but he's plenty strong. There's not a lot that's going to kill him right now. Upgrade the magic. Upgrade the fun. Eh, let's do it anyway. <laughs> now, now um, this thing's even more powerful. Regenerates faster. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Those guys really are tough. Don't want to underestimate them. Okay. Up here we got... Ooh, Troll Chieftain. Really a pain. Gonna ignore them for a little bit. Or not, not release them for a little bit. Also, so there's an ability that increases the range of arrow towers. And when you get that... The range of the the snipe it, it goes to like here. It's crazy. It cover most of the map. Uh, so yeah, it's really good. <laughs> Suffice it to say, I would like to get it eventually, but I might not because if I when I enact heroes that talk, take uh, 15 stars, you just can't use upgrades much. But the heroes are great. <laughs> I just want to hold it off. If I somehow don't die at all until I get to like the end, I'm gonna activate the heroes for the last three stages. So, I, I just want people to see them, at least. Eh, right on your head. Oh god, he's still not dying. There, thank god. The trolls, at this point, when I can upgrade this high, aren't a huge deal. Unless... <laughs> they have a chieftain, and then just the regular trolls are rough, because they go faster, they have higher armor, they have higher attack, it's crazy. They'll just overwhelm you. So, nuked his dumb face. Wolf, more wolves, also wolves. Alright, this is a crazy wolf round. I don't, I hope I have the resources to deal with it. Because it's coming. Should it have come before these guys died? Probably not. But... Pew! Alright, middle's definitely taking it. Bottom's taking it. Uh, I don't like that, though. We're just going to plop this down. <laughs> Way too many guys in the middle. They're all going into the meat grinder now. Let's do poison. Let's do... Oh, can't make that higher yet. Alright, well, we wiped them out. Now Now there are yetis coming after us, apparently. <laughs> they have 2,000 health, if you remember. Now, this is where the polymorph can either be really good or just screw you. Because the polymorph will just turn them into a yeti, or turn them into a sheep that has half the health. But I've had sheep run right past me because they have 1,000 health, and they're, the towers are fighting other things. And my guys don't block them. They run right past my golem. <laughs> so, you just gotta be careful as well. And we're gonna upgrade this to max. Um, I don't even know if that is upgraded to max. Eh. Yeah, I might be able to upgrade that more. It's possible. <laughs> Good. And we got more rocket riders. Do, can, do we have what it takes? Um, it's gonna make... Another one of these. I was almost able to fully upgrade that. That would have been cool. I don't know why I'm putting that guy there. <laughs> um, let's blast you. I just got the sunburned achievement. So let's just use him as a model. Ah, this could... Yeah, the guys might get through. You're dead. Good. Got him. Okay, we did it. Uh, I thought people were going to get through there. I really did. Okay, yeah, no, this is maximally upgraded. It's not giving me the option anymore. So, 200 
damage just on command. Very nice. Good for finishing guys off. And it's magic, so I'm guessing it, it goes past those guys' armor. I do wonder if it gets affected by people with magical armor, but there's it's kind of unknowable. Not this. Alright. Now, I'm less worried about armored troops on that top one. If I get another mage's tower, it'll probably be the other variety, the arcane tower that just disintegrates, folks. Yeah, very close. Arcane, wizard's tower. All right, and we don't want those chieftains to live, but I'm going to let their... Uh, wanna, oh, actually, <laughs> we might not need this. I think I'm going to use... Uh, yeah, let's just use that anyway. Good. You need to die. Uh, let's not. I'm not going to do polymorph for the reasons I described, but we're going to make that more powerful. All right, yeah, my golem's doing a good job of blocking people. Let's get the teleporter. Teleport people backwards. I got it at level two. Maximum enemies. Uh, so, so yeah, every ten seconds, enemies will be teleported back farther in, that are in range, which is really cool. It's really good. He's probably dead. Are you probably dead? Let's, oh, there you see, he just teleported all the way back into his cave. Excellent. Uh, I do want to get the uh, Daba Krava and uh, disintegrate, folks. Let's do that. All right, these guys are all very close together, which means, you know, let's keep them together. They'll learn the power of friendship by staying together. That Yeti is looking a little bit worried, but I got to remember I have the elementals, so it's probably not too bad. All right. Stop you right there. Stay in the corridor of horrors. Pow. <laughs> he just teleported back. And he has... Oh, he doesn't have armor anyway. I'm assuming if they have no armor that the curse doesn't make them even more vulnerable. But maybe it does. It's possible. And I haven't upgraded my artillery at all. It's probably fine at this point. But I want it. I want it for me. Let's do that. And dead. Upgrade that. Oh, dear. <laughs> okay. The ball. I didn't realize it was the final level. Okay. Uh, I'd, I'd like to upgrade those guys to block more, but I mean, they're probably fine. We got this guy, but I'm assuming some people... Okay. This thing also uh, freezes your towers and will make them stop working. And then you have to click them to make them work again. I also need to remember to shoot him, because he has, what is it? He has um, 11,000 health. He's down to 8,000. That's pretty good, considering he's here. But he's going to come down here and then just go. So, I also don't need to worry about unfreezing this, I guess. Because uh, what's it, what's it going to matter? <laughs> it's like I can't give commands to my troops. Doesn't I'm not going to be upgrading them. Here. Yeah, so let's, let's just ignore that one. Uh, good. So as long as I don't get two yetis, like, or I think one of them might just walk past if there's two yetis. Eh, click, 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 click. I'm trying to see if I can... If I position my mouse in a certain place, I think it makes the uh, clicks a little bit less loud on the recording, but it's, you're still just going to hear them. The microphone's a bit sensitive. There. There. Okay. Let's put this right here. Good. He's down to half health. Now, the, the real issue with this guy is that once he comes, he sends a cavalcade of enemies. And because of that, uh, guys can just get through eventually. Let's do that. We got another snipe. That should help. We're upgrading him even more. He's now a maximum level golem with insane amounts of HP. Uh, all right, so he hasn't taken a lot of damage in the interim. He took a lot of damage up there, but now it's been slowing down. So we want to change that. And he's poisoned. Cool. Oh, God. Yeah. 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 <laughs> All right. My, uh, my soldiers up there got engaged. Also, if he gets by, we lose. Did I mention that? <laughs> he has 20 death, and I don't like how close he's getting. I have to say, I do not like how close he's getting. Uh, what, is, what are you at? What are you at? 3,000. Oh, man. All right. Do that. Alright, he's fighting my golem now. If he gets through that, uh, he just ate it. He just instantly ate it. What the hell? <laughs> Not cool. Uh, eh. Uh, I think a wolf is getting through. Eh, what are you at? Oh, okay, we got him. 
Huh. Also, I don't know when it happened, but a whole bunch of guys got past me. I was too busy clicking towers and looking around. So, only two stars. <laughs> but, um, I have gotten three stars on the stage, but it was hard. I had to go back. I definitely didn't do it the first time. Alright, so 21 minutes in. Boy, was that ever a stage. Uh, let's see. Mage tower constructs are cheaper. More deployment. Okay, I got it. I got a far shots. Increase marksman's range. It's so good. It's too good. It's so powerful. All right, so we've moved on to the wastes. We have arrived at the dreadful realm of Venlardil. This is a barren and forsaken land where the wretched souls of the departed find no solace. Pray to the gods that this place does not take its toll on your men's spirits. All right, this is one of my favorite things. It turns the artillery into a Tesla cannon. So, um, shoots bolts of electricity that can strike multiple ground and flying enemies. It also makes it into a flying able thing. So like, it can attack air units finally. How good is that? Good. That's the answer is good. It's quite good. Um, I do actually want to see really quick, though. Well, this is, in fact, the third to the last stage, but I don't want to do the thing that I said about the hero. I think I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna leave it like this. Uh, next stage, I will be enacting heroes. Absolutely. Regardless. There's three heroes. Two of them are so identical, though, that I'm fine with just showing two of them. So, it's like there's one ranged hero and there's one... There's two melee heroes. The melee heroes just don't seem to have any special abilities. So... They just have slightly different stats. One has more attack, one has more defense. So they can come from either here or here. This is the exit. We want... This is going to be the most important thing. Going to make it a... Bombarder, specifically because it's going to turn into a Tesla, and it's going to be amazing, and you will see the power. I probably should have put it here. Too late, though. Instead, this is going here. We want blocker here, and, glory. and a blocker here. This will be a mage tower that I'll turn into a scorcher, and then I can hopefully make a golem sit right there, assuming they get past both of my forces there, which they have a good chance of doing. <laughs> like a charm. Oh god, I just remembered something. There's actually another spawn point. And I just had a playthrough where on the second wave, like, five guys got through, so we gotta rethink this. Um, here I definitely want this. Fully loaded. Um, we want magic. Might and magic. Let's try arrows here. Ready. Bombard here. Want some? We can get a guard here. Charge. Yeah. The hero helps so much with this one, though, because you can just plant a hero right here. This, I might, if if I fail this time, I'm not, if things start going horribly wrong, like they just did, I did not show that, um, I will not, I'll just show the failed attempt, and then we're going to activate hero. And then you'll see the difference a hero can make, even when you don't have the upgrades. I just really like to show the long-range uh, arrow thing. This is level one. Look how far the arrow goes. That's level two. By the time you get to the higher levels, it covers so much ground. It's amazing, and I love it, but we'll see if that's viable. Let's put a guard here, just to stop them at my towers. That'd be good. And... Let's get a level 2. That Alright. I hope this goes better this time. <laughs> I certainly have a different configuration. Um, by the way, so what I was... Why I said you could put a hero right here. I forgot that I cut out the other part and you don't know. Um, this is also a spawn point. It's a special spawn point <laughs> that just this stage has. Um, you'll see. You'll see why that graveyard is sometimes worrying. Okay, yep, skeletons are rising from the grave, as they are wont to do occasionally. <laughs> so, if you have a really strong warrior that you can just plant there, it can just repeatedly kill all of the zombies, and then you don't even have to worry about that. Um, guys are definitely getting through, though. I don't know if that was necessary. It probably was, though. I mean, I just would have had one armor thing to deal with it. I'm gonna put an additional magic thing here. So we're dealing with zombies there, but they're never gonna stop. All right, and we have that there. The wolves probably won't be an issue. Yeah, I just 
severely damaged one of them, in fact. <laughs> yeah, wolves are done. It's really this side that's more of a problem with the armored brigands coming in. I would love to get more more magic right here, but... I mean, and eventually, I definitely want to get the maximum bombardment because that's going to help a ton, but I, I, I have to wait on that. I'm going to have to wait a while, probably. I think we can kill those guys. I would like to fire the... Yeah, I'd like to fire this wave if I can. They're getting close together, which is good. Yep, let's drop fire right. Damn it, my guys are interrupting them. They're not going to walk into the fire in time. There we go. Fire. And I think he's going to... He did not escape the fire. Excellent. Beautiful. Um, bunch of zombies over here. <laughs> and now wolves are going to give just run right past my defenses. I, yeah, I, I knew I wasn't going to get to block all those guys. Zombies distracted them. Uh, so I need more rapid fire here to deal with deal with threats. A few, few skeletons are trying to float on past. And we're going to deal with some gargoyles next. Zombies are getting through. Come on, come on, come on, conscripts. There. Yeah, no, guys are... It's just, it's just hard. It's hard without the hero, for sure. Uh, there we go. Hopefully that's enough to more more thoroughly deal with them. All right. Uh, are those guys going to get through also? I think we got them. Cannon fodder achievement. Why? I don't know. Good. The arrows are able to take out a skeleton now by themselves. That's good. Um, should be able to take out a gargoyle, right? Yeah. Especially when I upgrade it. And he's not escaping by going up there because the thing has incredibly long range at this point. Alright, wolves coming. Wolves become a new enemy. Demon spawn. Terrible infernal creatures that explode when they die, damaging nearby soldiers. Magic resistance. Infernal combustion engines. The infernal combustion engine. <laughs> All right, these guys are going to get through. I maybe should have saved them from that. Maybe they wouldn't have gotten through. Damn it. I forgot that I had the, like, heavy arrow thing going on there. Um, I am severely lacking in magic on the other side, though. That's why they're doing so well. And how are you guys? 500, medium armor, no magic over there. Could be an issue. I Yeah, I should have... I shouldn't have blown my, my uh, fire spell on those wolves, I think. Can we kill... Yes. All right. That should do some major damage to them. Pew. 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 Yeah, that, that's taking huge chunks out of him. Your armor shall not protect you, fool. Yeah, the cannon plus these, this is locking down the, the skeletons. The problem is that when anything else comes, like wolves, for example, it's just not enough <laughs> to stop all of them. There we go. I, I put a little interruption so not all the wolves got there at once. That seemed to help a lot. Uh, Gargoyle's good, as long as it's not Rocket Riders. Now, I would love to level up one of the... Maybe this one. Okay, so that's level three now. That's good. Infernal guys coming in. Flyers will be here soon. I don't want to start them early. Are you... He's not getting hit by magic yet. That's why he's not taking any damage. You, you're getting hit by magic now. All right. They're coming, whether I want them to come or not. I don't think he's even going to make it to my troops good. Okay. These ones should die. Okay. They don't tell you when new skeletons come, but this is a skeleton knight. He's not just a regular old skeleton. So he might cause some issues. Let's upgrade that. Uh, I thought the gargoyles down there would be... Oh, actually, it looks like this side's getting torn up more than that side. I thought since this one had so many arrows, it'd be crazy. But I guess I needed to get to the arrow uh, death machine first. All right, let's release you guys. That that I thought that was going to be way more of a problem. I have to be honest. Mium. Mium. Do battle. Okay, wolves are done. Skeletons are coming. Infernal guys on the bottom. We are on wave eight. Of 19... <laughs> this is so crazy. Boom, look at that range. That's what I want. <laughs> they can hit anywhere on the map, pretty much, except for right at the starting area. It's, it's completely insane. 
Boom. Uh, this is getting a little bit much, though. There we go. <laughs> Let's take care of that issue right now. Boom. That thing hadn't even been upgraded once. Damn. It's a pretty important one since it can hit both sides. Alright, Demon Lord and Demon Spawn. Demon Lords lead fiendish armies into battle, protecting their minions with infernal shields. Shields other demons, magical resistance, infernal combustion, so they also explode. Those guys are messed up. They're the shamans of the demon world. Uh, yeah, we'll see what happens, <laughs> but they are indeed rough. Okay. They're coming. So you guys, yeah, you guys are just, let's check them out. 1,000 health. Magical damage. Well, there's no, there's no magic over here anyway, so their armor's useless. They're effectively unarmored. So that's nice, I suppose. Let's do that. Okay. And now... Good timing, because the skeletons are coming. Yeah. Good. That was a nicely placed fire spell. By me. Thank you, me. You're welcome, me. Beautiful. And we got... Okay, that was... Work of art. All right, we're getting ready to get the Tesla coil, which I do so love. We just need three under nice. We got that price reduction, which I was mocking before, but comes to situations like this, I like it. All right, new enemy. Demon hounds, vicious, terrible creatures. They serve as hunting dogs for the demon lords. So they're the infernal wargs. All right, there. You just wait till I get my Tesla coil, because it has my favorite upgrade in the game. Alright, there's another Demon Lord down there, which isn't the best, but... These guys are getting a little bit too big for their bridges. I think we can leave them, but it's way more important that I deal with the demons than worry about them. And they're dead anyway. I'm a little bit behind the curve. Cool. Stopped them. Shielded. Blah. Alright, right there. Shield against this, fools! And <laughs> they all live. Shielded against it. Gotcha. And... Tesla. Dwarven engineering at its finest. Harness the power of a thousand thunderstorms. Who should we aim at? I got specialist. I'm assuming that's for upgrading every... Or having each tower once. So the Tesla coil's great. Um, 66 to 120 damage, and it arcs. It arcs to different people. You can increase the number of people that it arcs to, but with this ability, that's not the cool ability, though. This is overcharge. Overcharge the tower, creating a static field that damages all enemies in proximity. 10 to 20 damage. You can upgrade that to, like, 40 damage. It's really good. If I can make one here, it's just gonna kill all the skeletons as they come out. But we're a little ways from that. We're getting there, though. And I think the bottom is a situation I'm going to have to deal with right now. Yeah, good. Got them all. <laughs> Look at all those skeletons. Oh, man. All right. So, static charge. Let's see when it goes off. Yep. It's going off. It's a little bit subtle. You can see that there's, like, electricity ripples through their body even when the charge isn't coming off. Even that did a lot of damage to them. Now it's up to 20 to 30. Next it'll be up at maximum level of 30 to 40 damage every few seconds to anything in range, which is why I put it here. It's going to hit both lanes. We might have the game locked down now, unless there's some sneaky boss that I'm forgetting about, which is very possible. Pew! Pew! <laughs> this thing is just bullseyeing these wolves. Now this could be bad. I can't block all of them, but now I can. <laughs> yeah, just keep running through, guys. It's great. This way, please. <laughs> if I didn't have my spell there, that that certainly could have been an issue. Alright. Two of them got through, but they're getting hit by Teslas and other things. Infernal Doges, and we got Demon Lords, Demon Spawns, and Demon Hounds. Alright, so I don't want to start early until we deal with these guys. Assuming we can. Oh, a few of those. One of those might get through. Yep. Can I stop him? The answer appears to be no. I stopped one of them, though. They should be able to handle that, but I don't know for sure. Actually, I, I guess they can't handle that. They got eaten. Oh, boy. Chomp, chomp, chomp. 
Well. Bully to you, demon lord. Reinforce! <laughs> It's like, where'd my army go, man? <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, he's down to one-third health. And this is almost ready to become a Tesla, which is going to make the skeletons a non-issue. At least, that's the hope. I've sacrificed a lot to go for the Teslas. I do know that. I, I don't know if it was the best use of my resources. That's why certain times guys are just getting through, but... You know, like, I don't even have this fully upgraded. Like, that would have saved me there. All right, it still saved me. I have made all the right decisions and never make mistakes. That is what the game has proven to me. Of course, I have 13 things, so I can't say that. But, you know, didn't go as bad as I thought. Oh, God. Dark Slayer and Dark Knights are down there. Yeah, how much do I need? I need 300 Blurderber. And I do get money from the skeletons. I thought I might not, since I don't know if they count as, like, real enemies. I mean, they're just skeletons. You know, they weren't coming from the kingdom. They just live here. They just woke up. I woke them up. Alright, I mean, the Dark Lord is getting through, but... Oh, ooh. Yeah, Tesla! Alright, I do need to get the upgrade where it actually, um, you know, does the pulse thing to take care of the skeletons, but we're getting there. And top is fine. I, like, I haven't upgraded this once. It's just I need a slight distraction. They don't need to distract them for long. This is this is a pretty good corridor of four things here. Okay, almost? Yeah, boom. This is going to hit them the second they leave. They're just going to start taking damage. I certainly approve of that. Alright, what's coming down the pipe? That could have been aimed better. Yeah, he didn't. He only took like half the damage before. But all right. Oh no, the shields. The shields did not help them <laughs> like at all. Boom. And you notice the skeletons died there. So he's being Tesla'd. And what do we got? We got rocket riders. Do I have enough for them? E. Uh, I would like to upgrade that to a elven archer thingy. For sure. Irradiate. Irradiate. So close. There we go. Alright, let's release him. Where are you? Die! Did I miss him? I missed him. <laughs> Alright. That was dumb. You have to hit them directly with that. But I guess the perspective was off a little bit. Alright, so he's done. There's nothing I can do about top, it looks like, besides what's happening. Looks like that's okay, alright. Damage started to stack pretty well. Uh, he might get through, but that could have been worse. Okay. Increase to max. <laughs> Let's see what happens to these hounds as they go through. Dead. All of them just died. <laughs> oh, so good. Skeletons, wow, 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 and it's like they get hit again when they come up here too. Let's upgrade that to max. Excellent. We've got a good system. I like the system. Even though I had to sacrifice everything for it, and it, it didn't always work out because I've lost like half my health. We are on wave 17, however. I can get behind that. Mmm, yeah, we don't need anything else. Come forth, fools. Come to your death. Put that there, and... Alright, he's done. Now he... That, there's two of them. Oh god, there's two of them. I didn't notice. I was looking at the wrong thing, clearly. Poison to try to actually get through their arm. They're gonna get through, and they do three damage. I'm gonna lose six, unless I can kill him. Which I can't. Okay. That was bad. I completely ignored that side. We're down to six health. We could lose. <laughs> oh well. Um, Zoop. I mean, I should have. I should have been concentrating more on magic this side. This side is weak. But like the zombies creeped me out so much that I, would, I was concentrating on that one too much. But this side needs magic. This side needs like rapid stuff and things that can take multiple targets. Which, I like that they were asymmetrical in this game. They made you consider everything. They made you use the different mechanics. 
There we go. Scorch Tower to deal with any and all armored troops. Did I miss them? No, I guess I didn't. <laughs> I guess that worked out fine. All right, so as soon as I can get... Now, this side, this... If it always used it on here, this wouldn't be a bad time to have Polymorph. Polymorph could actually be pretty amazing there. Also, hello, <laughs> Golem time. That should help. <laughs> that should help quite a bit. Okay, uh, see if we can get some assassination going. And once I get my fire, I'm going to target that Demon Lord. Okay. I don't think I need... Yeah, I didn't need to. They, all the troops just died due to the Teslas, because this part, I sa again, sacrificed everything for this double Tesla block here. Um, I could get them. I really just need more magic, don't I? Yeah, let's, let's make a dedicated magic to this side. And we're on the last wave, actually. I don't need to do a damn thing. I just need to hold out. Which side is more deadly? I think this side, this side is more deadly. Uh, I could be wrong looking bound them, but it's just this side isn't defended as well. So, yeah, that probably helped. These are all skeleton knights. What the hell, man? <laughs> How much health do they have? Yeah, 400. Most of them are dead. Uh, poison, trap, trap, trap. Uh, upgrade these guys. Stop. Both sides look like they were a little bit rough. I just completely neutralized one with uh, fire. But, yeah, the Tesla should be enough to kill these guys now. That that could have sunk me. Freedom! Freedom. Alright, I think we're good. I can't imagine that Hell Lord getting through, and these guys aren't even... I mean, we got this guy, but he's already, like, a third... A third of his health is all that's left. Uh, Polymorph, Polymorph, Poly... Alright, there's no one that they're gonna Polymorph. They just got... Oh my god, I just realized the combination of, um... The trap that, that traps people and the, um... And the Tesla coil. Pretty great. <laughs> How do I... What do you need to do to get one star? If I can get <laughs> two stars at, at six hearts, that's very confusing. Not complaining. Not saying they should give me one star. No, no, no. But... All right, um, it doesn't matter what I get because I'm resetting everything. And we're going to go unlock heroes. And the, the video's over. It's just I just want to reallocate my skills. So, yeah, we have her. We have him. We have him. I think I'm going to show her and him. Um, the first level will be her. She's cool because she has a ranged attack. And she can hit things uh, in the air. However, she's very weak if people get close up, so you have to micromanage her a little bit better. These two guys, you can just plant in front of something. They're probably just going to mess things up. If a hero dies, by the way, they come back in a few seconds. Basically, like all the other stuff, it's not a big deal. And they gain experience, so they get more powerful throughout the level. Special ability, multi-shot. So she can shoot a bunch of arrows. Um, he has shields of retribution. Don't know what that does. He has a smash. That, like, hurts people in an area. I, I think he's the better character of the two. But, um... Yeah, I need to reallocate all my skills now. I know I'm gonna do this. I guess I'm not. I'm gonna run out if I do that. Huh. I guess I don't need that as much, like this as much, if I have the hero. So let's just do all the level 1 ones. Um... And we want, we want the, definitely the Fire Scorch and the Increase. And I think I want it all the way up to here. Because that's just good. So that doesn't leave me with too much options. I want Increased Marksman range, though. <laughs> yeah. So I won't get Increased Increased Marksman. Alright, so these are my new skill abilities. You saw how much I just sacrificed just to get a hero, but it is in general worth it. If I had the hero on the other stage, it would have gone entirely differently. But... I am Cross Knights. On the next episode, I will, in fact, be doing the last two stages. We are no longer defending. We are in the heart of the beast, fighting literal demons. So I hope you'll join me for the conclusion of Kingdom Rush. I will go back and get those stars I lost, or I won't. We'll see. I probably will. 
It's just gonna take a long time, but I think I have the time. So, I'll see you guys then. Thanks for watching. Thanks for my patrons. Later.